For many Derby County fans, today's win doesn't dampen their anger. Their club is heading into administration, blaming the pandemic for a £20 million black hole in its finances. A little bit devastated, to be honest. Uh, it's, it's really hard to put into words what wow, most of us are feeling. Yeah, feeling pretty sad about it all, really angry that the club's been allowed to get into this position. Um, we need some answers. We knew what things were bad, but we didn't think it was that bad. But we just have to start again, don't we? We'll still come, won't we, next season, yeah. wherever we are. So. I feel a bit nervous and worried for the club, but I know that we can get through this, and it's happened to a lot of teams, and us fans need to stand strong, and we will rise again. In a statement last night, the club said, We cannot stress enough how devastating it is to be forced into this position. This season, COVID-19 has continued to have a negative effect on revenues. Unlike other sectors, football has been able to only marginally reduce its cost base, with the majority of outgoings being associated with playing staff, who obviously could not be furloughed. Today, there was one noticeable absence in the stadium car park. Owner Mel Morris doesn't normally miss a game. He's been trying to sell the club since 2019, but with no success. Now the fans' finger of blame is pointing firmly in his direction. Hello everybody and welcome to a breaking news episode of the Rams Review podcast. The man that broadcasts his love for the club on a weekly basis now believes the government should step in. Something's got to happen. I mean, no disrespect to the other clubs this, this has happened to and I'm sure they think they're, they're a big club in their own right, but Derby County are, have got a huge history. They're, they're one of the founding members, obviously, of the Football League and for it to happen to a, to a club like this, whilst it has been poorly managed... Um, yeah, I think they've got to look at it and go, how can we sustain before more and more football teams go out of business? Manager Wayne Rooney now leads a team looking at a 12-point deduction on top of a punishment for breaking financial rules. And fans are getting used to the prospect of being in League One next season. Administrators will be appointed soon to work a way through what's left, but fans are certain the problem is written in black and white. Lewis Warner, ITV News, Derby.